103.5 WEZL on the web at WEZL.com. Toby Keith and Whiskey Girl on WEZL. You awake? I am awake. Okay, just checking. You just seem a little... Well, I stayed up late last night watching that show you've got me hooked on. America's Got Talent. And I know that I could oh. just tape it and watch it later, but I never have time later. Mm-hmm. So uh, I watched it last night. I'm not all that impressed with it. Well, why'd you watch it? Well, at that I was waiting for the old lady to come on, but I guess they've divided them up in 12s now. Are there okay. 24 left? I don't know. I hadn't watched it this week. Oh. Well, I, I just watched... watched it last week when they sent a bunch of people on to Hollywood or wherever they go. I watched uh Las Vegas. I watched the whole 2 hours and never saw the um the old lady, the old lady comedian. Now, and and I think you and I both think she used to I, I think she's been here. I do, too. She looks familiar to me. I think Tony's brought her here because I told Judy right before she started last week when we were watching it, I said, uh, if I recall correctly, this woman's having to tone down a whole lot. If I, I remember her being fairly nasty. <laughs> yes. And she even said that. I saw uh, the reason I started watching America's Got Talent was because I saw, I guess they're running it on one of their other stations that, that they own, their cable stations. Yeah, yeah. And um, like TV Guide Network or, or one of those. And she said that. She said, yeah, I'm going to have to clean it up a little bit. And she was an still interview. very edgy last yeah, week. Yeah. Uh, Talking I guess about that, things she'd do with peers and. Well, I don't know about all that. Pulling the underwear out of her. Uh, yeah, exactly. That's yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I guess that's what makes her funny in person is you don't expect. Just a little Greg old lady to, to be, be telling dirty jokes. Yeah, she's 75 years old, and I, I think she's probably just as nasty as any of them. What do you think about the, uh, the, the chicken catcher from Kentucky? What's your thoughts on him? I Did you see the very first time? Yeah, well, I, I went back triumphs. and watched because okay. they had a marathon on Sunday, okay. and they just played all of them. I don't know. I get the impression that that's, that's an act. I, I don't know that he's really that simple. You think? I do. I, I think this is one of those things where he said, okay, I, I can sing a little bit, but if I have a story to go along with it, this is what's making other people famous. I think he's probably from, like, upstate New York or something. Do you really? Yeah, and he's putting – because the act is too simple. I I personally think it's probably real. He probably – is about the best singer around where he's from, uh-huh. but I don't know that he's got enough talent to get through a couple more rounds. The first time he was really good because he was such a surprise. Uh-huh. I thought last week he was shaky, and they and they said how great he was, and he's a great story, and I did that. But I thought he was iffy last week. Mm-hmm. I think he's, so. You think he'll fizzle out like Susan Boyle? I I, I think uh, if he's there two more weeks, he'll be lucky. I like the guy. I like the story. Like the concept. It'd be nice if he could do it. Yeah, but I I don't. Um, I just get the impression he's too simple, so I really don't know that it's real. Mm-hmm. Because people are getting smart now with this. Uh, with how these, how to with pull these it off? Shows. Yeah. So your favorite right now is who? Um. I know you don't like the show. You said you didn't, but who do you who do you think's night, actually got talent? Last night of the twelve that performed over the two hours, I like the uh, the girls that were dancing, the moms that were dancing. And I don't, I don't know their name, but they're, they're not older. I would say that they're the, the uh, men dressed up the drag queens. No, I don't. Oh, I don't. You, they you were dressed like real? they were dressed like firemen last night. I don't know. The, the ladies were, mm-hmm. and they did it to a popular uh, song that's out. Okay. But um, they did an excellent job last night, and I also like the chubby guy, with who really, really loves his dancing partner wife, who slings her around. Have you seen him? I don't know what he. <laughs> He's, he's kind of a chubby fella. That sounds a little bit like something North Charleston police probably ought to investigate. <laughs> he's, but he, a chubby fella who slings his wife around. <laughs> it's it's one of those acts where, you know, it's balance and, and she'll lift him up just, you know, using, I using, no, I the, law, using the laws of physics. I must have missed he's, that he's one. He's a chubby fella, but she can, she can push him up and I mean, it's one of those circus acts. Really? But uh, they were really good last night. Okay, so you don't. Uh, for you, it's the uh, it's the circus acts that, that you like. Yeah, because the I dancing don't, and the I balancing think, and the. First of all, I don't think that that should be a singing competition. At what? All. That's not talent. No, it is talent. But there's other shows for that. Mm-hmm. There's other shows for dancing too. <laughs> well, I guess I guess that's true too. You know. But it, 
you know, some of these people that come out there and do it on this show, why? Are, how come they have an audition for... One of them did. And one of them that's in the uh, 24 was actually a competitor on American Idol. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. And uh, I think got through to a certain point and, uh, I mean, did okay. Yeah. Uh, but I think, if I recall correctly, she may be one of the favorites in this thing. Okay. Uh, it's a it's a woman. I don't I don't remember young girl. I don't remember the deal. But uh, uh-huh. anyway, I, I I personally like the magician. I, th- well, I think he the, wasn't in that twelve. Okay, well a, I, th- I think the magician's probably the best talent of all of them, and probably the most suited for Las Vegas. I saw him on YouTube, so yeah, I'll agree with you on that. I, I think he's the man that should win so far. Of the twelve last night, I like the uh, the chubby man that slings his wife around. Yeah, and, and, and those, again, that sounds like something that North Charleston police ought to investigate. And those hot moms that dressed up like firemen. Okay, I can. Okay, six twenty. I can. See, I can see that <laughs> that you would say that. Yeah, yeah twenty. <laughs> freckles. Did you buy freckles a, a fireman suit? <laughs> Not yet, but we're going to look today. Uh, six twenty at WEZL. <laughs> now, Weasel time.